Temple, Temple, Temple. The best golfers of all time. The legends, they've all had great Temple. What is it and how do I practice it? Well, we're gonna talk about that today and help you improve your Temple, which is gonna drastically help you improve your ball striking. I'm PGA teaching professional Todd Kolb, Director of Instruction for US Golf TV and the Sanford Power Golf Academy. And when we think of some of the all-time great golfers, they have great tempo. Now, some of those tempos are a little faster and some of them are a little bit slower, but at the end of the day, it is a consistent tempo that is most important. So I wanna talk about that a little bit here today. So what is tempo? Well, tempo to me is like cadence. It's like a rhythm. Think of it in terms of how fast some people talk. Some people talk a little faster, some people talk a little slower, right? Some people walk faster normally, some people walk slower. There is no right or wrong, but what makes it right or wrong is the consistency of it. And that's when you're thinking of tempo, think of the consistency of the rhythm, the consistency of the pace, that's what good tempo is. Now, how do you practice that? Well, there's a lot of different ways you can practice it. Personally, for myself, here at the Golf Academy, I like to use the power stick. Uh, because it's really simple, it gives some good audio feedback and you can really feel it in your hands. Now why is that? Well, it's got this flexible shaft with a little bit of weight on the end of it. What the flexible shaft allows the golfer to feel, especially with the weight on the end of it, is it allows it to feel kind of the release of the golf club and the flow of the golf club. So this is a nice simple way for me to practice that rhythm and that tempo. Now the drill that I like to do with the power stick is what I call a continuation drill. So when something is in continuous motion, it doesn't matter what it is, any object, when it's in continuous motion, what you'll notice is, is that the rate at which it moves stays relatively consistent. So when I swing this, when I swing the power stick, and I just stay in continuous motion, back and forward, I'm not swinging super fast, you'll notice, the rate at which I'm swinging, the tempo, the speed, is nice and consistent. Now, if I just make one swing and then stop, okay, now I gotta start all over again and it's easier for me to get off track and swing too fast or too quick. So, when I'm swinging and I'm in continuous motion, naturally everything starts to kind of fall into place. So, good tempo and good rhythm is about consistency. It doesn't have to be fast, it doesn't have to be slow, but it's gotta be consistent. This simple drill, the continuation drill, can help you feel that and will definitely improve your tempo and therefore improve your golf game. 